Hello mga ka-crew! What's up? It's Chaska. Homestand by duty ako ngayon. Papakita ko sa inyo kung ano yung usually kong ginagawa on a homestand by duty or ano yung mga posible kong gawin. Ano ba yung mga limitations, responsibilities? I-discuss natin yan later in today's vlog. Let's start! <laughs> Not run. Not run. run kundi lang. As a morning person who wakes up at around 8:30, I want to be productive. And meron tayong dalang bag. So nadito yung mga wallet ko, susin ng car. And ano pa? Sige, magano ka? Hall. No ka magulo, magulo, magulo. <laughs> So we're gonna run to test natin yung stability ng camera. Let's go! It's a race! Oh, hey. <laughs> It's a race in the air! It's a race Kasi ano, kasi may dahawak ang camera. Hindi talaga ako nag-run eh. Like, oh, <laughs> between her and I, I like the treadmill better than she yes, does. Yes, yes. Hindi talaga ako nakakatagal. Grabe. Treadmill? <laughs> 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 And now we're gonna grab some fox. iPad, kailangan ako charge siya. Mga essentials ko, I have to make sure na it's here sa flight bag. And of course, yung uniform kailangan ko na rin siya if it's up. So, let's go. Let's 
check the battery percentage. So it's 62% sufficient charge. So anyway, charge pa rin natin to 100%. My shoes. So right now I'll just freshen up. Bongo pa naman. So right now na freshen up na ako. And tignan niyo outfit ko. Yes, care of Claire. Wait, may apps dito ah. Sobrang busy day. She is editing. So anyway, guys, let's talk. Yes, formal. So today, ang schedule ko or nakaplotted na duty time sa akin for home standby, it's 12 to 6 p.m. So ayan, meron kaming tinitignan na app called Aims to check our schedule for the rest of the week or month if published na siya. I have home standby. So for those who don't know yet, so home standby or HS, so by definition, basahin ko muna, is the duration of time other than day off where a flight crew is at an agreed location for the purpose of notification of an assigned duty for that day. So ayan, binasa ko ayan. So nasa operations manual namin to. So anyway, ang home standby for us is half duty, half day off. So anyway, Bawal lang kaming lumabas or kung lalabas man kami within the area lang sa kung saan kami naka-assign na base. For example, kakain lang naman sa labas, within the area, sa home mo. Okay lang naman yun as long as makarating ka sa office, assign duty mo within 2 hours after being notified for a flight. Yun, may mga instances na like last time, nagkaroon kami ng aircraft evacuation, upgrade ako. So nakarating ako in less than 2 hours. Actually, sa buong time na nag-work ako. Siguro mga 10 to 15 times pa lang ako na-upgrade. Pero this uh, pandemic, once pa lang ako na-upgrade sa lahat ng mga times na nag-home standby ako. Siguro mga 4 to 5 times a week akong home standby. So another thing to note is when a flight crew is called out from home standby or HS, he or she shall be notified at least 2 hours prior to the reporting time. Yun naman sa side ng mga crew control or sa mga people na nag-upgrade sa amin na kailangan manotified kami 2 hours prior to our reporting time. And another thing to note is home standby period shall not exceed the maximum of 10 hours for us flight deck crew. And also, dapat for me ha, like hindi naka-silent mode yung phone ko and make sure na may reception ako and naka-apple watch ako para I don't miss out any notifications just in case ma-upgrade ako sa flight. And also, may mga responsibilities tayo of course bilang flight crew na meron tayong tinatawag na 8 hour rule or 8 hours bottle to throttle for us kasi mga pilots part ng responsibility naming mga pilots is to make sure hindi kami nakakonsume ng alcohol or 8 hours prior to our flight duty or home standby duty so kahit na home standby kami hindi dapat kami mag drink or mag consume ng alcohol kasi anytime pwede talaga kami tawagan and did you know guys na if more than 0.04% ang aming blood alcohol concentration sa aming body, if nag-positive kami during test, hindi kami allowed lumipad by law. Siyempre, of course, we don't wanna fly with pilots na intoxicated, di ba? So, yun. Part talaga sa responsibility namin, ayan, nakalagay dito sa aming operations manual na a crew member shall not consume alcohol during flight duty period or whilst on standby. How do I prepare? So I've mentioned kanina na I have to check my stuff if complete ba yung mga important stuff like headset, um, vest, reflective vest, flashlight, earplugs, iPad, shades, and lahat ng na mga nasa 
what's in my pilot's bag. So, yan. Panoorin nyo na lang kung ano yung mga crucial stuff na kailangan. An additional thing na ginagawa ko is mayroong feature kasi sa Ames or sa e-crew namin na app na makikita namin yung mga list ng mga flights within the day or, or kung ano yung expect nating flights for the day. So, from there, I can prepare na at home and also prepare ko na rin yung uniform ko ahead kasi pag nag-rush ka sa mga bagays and pag hindi mo talaga in-expect yung mga unexpected, most of the time, may rush ka, may miss out ka, may stress ka, and madadala mo yun sa whole flight. So, preparation is key and expect the unexpected. And lastly, of course, I have to be physically, emotionally, and mentally prepared for the flight. And of course, part din sa responsibility namin na well-rested kami, physically fit for the flight. So, anyway, today, what I'm planning to do is to edit lang yung mga vlogs, na upcoming vlogs. So, ang dami nun natambak na, and probably Probably go on ng mga indoor content. And probably we're gonna expect some guests to arrive later. So right now I'm currently editing our QA vlog. na yung home style ba ko and mag-dinner date kami ni Claire. Here's our outfit. I think I need to change. Part 2! Here's our outfit. Change outfit. Half of these are her clothes. So right now, naka-decide na kami kumain pa. Nanam! Nanam! Beautiful sight! Oh! I like your outfit. It's kind of Cheska. <laughs> it's half Cheska. Oh, yeah. This was these, are your shoe, these are your sandals. This is your this jacket. Whatever. Here we are. Man, uh, Man American Airlines. I'll be getting natural eyelash extensions. Alright, so natural sa kanya and see curl na walang lower, di ba? Ako, walang lower. Pwede mo ba yun lower? Oo, gusto mo ba matry? Sige, Lola! Talaga ba? Hindi ko alam na magugustahan mo mag-lower. Magpatagdaw. <laughs> and our guest for tonight, Leon and Andre. Yes. <laughs> Sleepy head. They're already long lashes. Guapo, guapo. Oh. Ito na yung lashes namin. It's all good. Ayan. So first time ko mag-lash uh, extension. Natural lang talaga yung pinini ko kasi uh, gusto ko subtle lang and gusto ko pang tignan kung ano yung itsura ko nang naka-extend yung lashes. If like thicker, thicker yung lashes ko. So, anyway, uh, thank you so much for watching our vlog. So, thank yun. you. Sana nag-enjoy kayo with our little escapade within the area. <laughs> Bye! <laughs>